Hello, this is Hui. Welcome to watch my video C++ Programming on Linux. In this short video, we are going to demonstrate how to set up MySQL connector for C++ library on Debian Linux. The environment, uh, the Linux environment I was using and is Debian Linux. In one of our previous video, we have demonstrated how to write C++ code to connect to the MySQL database and how to load a CSV file to MySQL database. But in that video, we only focus on the C++ coding and uh, we didn't mention how to download and install MySQL database library. So since my Linux environment is Debian Linux, so I did download the MySQL connector C++ library from the Debian package website. Here's the website and uh, here's the library like li MySQL CPP CON and uh, this is uh, the location uh, the website which I have downloaded since this is the official Debian website and uh, I think uh, they are going to be pretty compatible. And uh, here's the uh, MySQL website. There's a connector C++ developer guide, which you can see how to download, how to install, and how to write some sample code. And uh, so after I did the download, here is uh, my, my computer, and I have downloaded three files. And uh, this is the file is uh, I downloaded called the library MySQL CPP CON dev and the version is 8.0.20 and that's because it's a free community version and uh, to install this Debian package file and uh, my Linux there's a pretty good tools called GDB and uh, here's the help for the GDB it is a pretty package install tools and there's also graphic version here's on the command line uh, view so how to do this? We just uh, write a gdb and then we use this slash and this is the file. So we click enter. And uh, these tools, the good thing for these tools is going to be first uh, scan your environment. And the one of a big scanning is scanning the dependency of your system. And uh, here on the DB website, they clearly, clearly specified for this library, there's a build dependence. So it means you have to install this before you install this. And uh, so sometimes you don't know how which one library of this, uh, like a dev helper, CMaker, or the live MySQL client dev, which uh, and all the boost dev and the SIR dev, this library has been installed or not installed. And these tools, these tools is going to instant uh, scanning and they will tell you what is not match, what is this you have to. So if something dependency, you know, give you error, you have to go download this dependency library before you install this final library MySQL CPP connector. So since my system I have done this, also I have, I have installed this MySQL client dev 8.020 and uh, then I installed. So since everything is already installed, so this is uh, building dependency tree checking and uh, there's no error come back. So but here I just hit no because the library has already installed. After you install the library, the only thing, two things you have to check where's the header file located. So by default, the header file located as a user include rs. So after check, I found my header file for this one has been installed under where's the So 
So it means I have installed under CD star CPPCON and understand my CQL, my CQL CPPCON 8 subdirectory. So this is a subdirectory. So, and uh, let the GD my SQL. So here there's a one header file called gdbc.h. Let's see this file. If you look at this file, you can see this file is only include all the necessary header file of JDBC and the CPP CLN, like a variant version and the SQL string, all the header file needed for this library. So, so in our program, let's see. This is a, a simple CPP file. Let's say we only need include this jdbc.h and uh, because this header file include all the necessary header file for this uh, MySQL con uh, connector library. And okay, so let's back to the, after check the header file and uh, we also need to check Where's the library installed? So by default, the library is installed user library. And, uh, and uh, for this uh, installation, because I just uh, selected uh, by default, it's installed my x86 underscore 64 Linux uh, GNU subdirectory. So there's a manual error, library, my SQL star. So you can see the library for the MySQL client CPP connection 8 will be installed. This is our library. So after we checked, we have successfully installed the header file and the library and we have to go to our application to check our modify, update our make files. So what we do for my make file here is a basic make file. So I have a the program called uh, my SQL select dot cpp, and uh, so we have to specify cc is the variable we give the G plus plus, which is our compiler, and we have to specify one thing is called C flags means compiler flags. So this compiler flags we can use minus C minus C means uh, compile only but not link. So, so this is a compiling, so flag. And the minor W, ALL, is means turned on the warning for all of warning. We do, you know, we can specify which warning we turn on, which not, but here we just, uh, by easy, we turn on the warning. As we mentioned, our head file for this uh, special file required my SQL connector is un installed under user include my SQL dash CPP CON dash eight. So we have to specify minor i use minor i option, which is include file. So it means if you have some include file required for compiler, they'll be going to this directory search after uh, didn't find from default directory, which means the user slash include. And uh, if you have is this option most used, if you have a third party library and uh, installed in separate place or our, you know, project library, head uh, file, we can also mention we, if we use the minor i, slash dot dot. Sometimes we put a, our own header file in this uh, separate directory and we can use and specify this one. And we also mentioned the library we required for compiler this program is called MySQL CPP CON library, which is we know we have installed under this location. And so we have to use the minor IL option to specify this library can be found under this directory. 
So after that, and the following this says, uh, you know, if we are uh, original for CPV file compared to the object file, we use in CC, this which is G++, and we use C flag, means we compile only, and uh, we use minor O, minor O means uh, output file. So from CPV file, after compile, we become the MySQL select dot O means object file. And the second step means uh, compile from MySQL dot O file to the executable file. Executable file, there's no extension. And uh, we're using the CC because the G++ both doing both compiling and the link. Otherwise, uh, if we need a special link, we can use the link command here. So, but if, when the compiler has link, we use the link flag, which means we have to specify which library we are going to to be used. So, in this case, and uh, here is the program. So the program we are going to do is going to connect to the database. Our query and our database, we have a table called player. We just run the basic query select like star from player. Here is the MySQL database. I have a table called player and we have three record. In this player, we just run a MySQL select like star from player. We have three record. So so here we after we run this query the result set and we just print out and the id name membership gender and the level is column of the, my table so this is the id name membership gender level this is the column we just print out so let's just save this and then we just make So after we make RS minor LTR, so here is a generate our executable, and we run this. You can see we got a query our table. We got a three, and the name John Bolan, Tom Pasquale, Martina Vorban here compared to C. And our table we have three: John Bolan, Tom Pasquale, Martina Vorban. So here is the basic uh, select example, which is connect to our MySQL database. Hello, this is uh, Hui. Thanks to watch my video. And uh, it's going to be great to have your feedback. Thank you.